I fell in love with a Scorpio. It's a crazy story though. She was super pretty, the baddest in my portfolio. She was super sweet, I would eat her up like a Oreo. I don't know how I got her, I'm giving God all the glory though. And she was born in October or November. I really cannot remember. I hope it doesn't offend her. She told me that she loved me because I was so sweet and tender. And I would always defend her. And I was not a pretender. <laughs> but one day she was acting so mysterious. I was curious, and honestly, I was furious. Wasn't talking to me, she really had me delirious. I was overthinking, I didn't know she was serious. I thought maybe she had found somebody else but honestly she told me she was working on herself she took some time off to focus on her mental health and i had to accept it regardless of how i felt huh. but all in all what i learned in the end is i love scorpios i swear scorpios are 10 but be careful because as soon as you get in she might turn around what's up y'all happy valentine's day this is my favorite holiday i love valentine's day um i just love all the red and all the love and all the balloons and stuff like that I did my rounds yesterday. I had to go give my mama all these roses. I filled up her whole room with roses this year. I know she like, I like my daughter sometimes. I'm like, I know, I know. I'm gonna do some stuff for her probably later on. All right, Scorpios, let's get into it. What you doing for, Scorp for Valentine's Day, Scorpios? All right, some of y'all was like, yeah, I got surprised. Yeah, okay. I don't know how to handle my emotions right now. So Scorpio, somebody is thinking about you on Valentine's Day and they don't know what to do. They want to talk to you, but they don't. They want to be with you, but they don't. They don't know what to do. Okay? It says, I really do care even though I don't show it. So somebody acts like they don't give a fuck about what you do, Scorpio. But damn, all they do is think about what you're doing, how you doing it, who you doing it with. I've been working on myself and... um, Hold on. I've been working on myself and I'm not the same as I was before. Okay? So Scorpio... Somebody just don't know what to do right now when it comes to you. They really been working on their behavior, how they see themselves, how they see you. And they just, you know, they really care about you, but they don't know how to show it to you. You know what I'm saying? They, they've been thinking about it a lot. It's Valentine's Day. But for real, this person ain't making no action towards you, Charlotte. All these cards are sideways. And if they got to think this much just to love, they in a real toxic place. You know what I mean? It don't take me hard to love. You know, I love my baby. I post my baby. I love my car. I post my car. And niggas will be like, oh, well, I love you, but I don't want people in my business. But you want people to know what kind of car you drive. You want people to know you love your baby. So don't be letting these niggas tell y'all stupid ass shit on Valentine's Day, especially if you a side piece today. And they could be in their thoughts like, I want to be with you, but I got to be with my man. <laughs> okay, so don't be letting nobody feed y'all nothing crazy today. But Scorpio, somebody is thinking about you and they really do want to show you that they care, but they day in their head about it. All right. These are the things that they want to say, though. They've been watching your social media and they've been admiring your pictures. So even if this nigga don't follow you, don't talk to you, he don't got social media. That don't mean niggas be lurking just like bitches do. OK, no disrespect, but for real. So whoever this nigga is, whoever this female is, they have been watching your social media and they love your pictures, man. They love what you got going on. It says, I'm sorry I couldn't be with you needed to be okay so this person feels really bad about just not showing up for you not being there for you not having your back and they realize it's kind of dumb to do that to you it's kind of dumb to not show up like that but you know this person is really feeling the weight of that now these are sideways so this person is kind of ready to commit um but they also afraid of commitment this is crazy look at this shit okay so scorpio this person do want to commit to you but they don't want to commit to other people. Then this person, this person wants you to commit to them, but they scared that you committed to other people. So this is somebody who's really in their head. You know, they have low self-esteem. A lot of people don't know they have low self-esteem until they meet somebody that's like, oh my God, to them. Like, oh, you fine as fuck. Everybody a fucking human, bruh. I don't care how fine this little girl look, how this fine this everybody a human. Everybody just want to be loved, okay? Like I said in my other reading, we are moving into a very lovable energy. This shit going to last until April. You're just going to be falling in love with people. It's going to be a lot of love hitting the table. It's going to be a lot of love hitting the universe because it's time for love to heal the world. The only real God we got is love. You see what I'm saying? Because when somebody show you some love, you know what it feel like. You know, it's so genuine. It's so pure. It's not manipulative. It's, it's, it's authentic. Okay. Whew. All right. I see this shit sideways too. I want to treat you the way you deserve. I know that we our souls have a connection. Bottom of the day, energy. You tame my demons in reverse. So Scorpio, somebody 
really feels like the the love they have for you the passion that they have for you the sex that they have for you is angelic okay stop playing with it okay y'all see this look like somebody opening their legs okay so scorpio i'm just telling you you tame my demons in reverse means that scorpio you are an angelic angel in this person life vice versa you could have met some nigga and you be like damn you know this nigga real pure he authentic he genuine he right he solid you know what i mean but this person is very scared about whatever attention you receive or you know whatever attention they think you are receiving it says, I know our souls are connected. So somebody just knows like bumping into you, running into you, talking to you is just not by chance. You know what I'm saying? And they want to treat you how you deserve. But this is somebody who has their foot halfway in and halfway out because of their past. Um, the universe could still be working on this person uh, for real. But somebody just feel like you are a healer. Your energy is healing. Your speech is healing. Your vibration is healing. Okay. And, and they, they love being around you because it's like you push out all they motherfucking demons. That's beautiful. Happy Valentine's Day, y'all. All right, somebody's still in their fucking head. It says, you're worth more to me than I let on. So somebody really do want to have a strong connection with you. They really love you, but they don't tell you this shit. I don't know if they're worthy of you, but they don't tell you this shit, all right? Look at this shit. They also pay attention to how you tell you. You don't taught this person how to run their checkup. When, when somebody taught me how to run my checkup with taming my demons, they were dead people, Napoleon Hill. But when I started to really study these billionaires, okay, you know, knowing that Elon Musk is autistic and how there's so many autistic kids, and these these, these are the kids that's going to make us rich, okay? I realized so much that why they drugging them, why they trying to dumb them down, okay? And um, it's something about you, Scorpio, that really tames this person's demons, really, really allow peace in this person's heart. You know what I mean? And they love that shit about you. You know, bottom of the day energy for my Scorpios. I want to apologize. I need your forgiveness. So somebody really wants you to forgive them, Scorpio. They really do. Uh, they could just be like, let me just yield to your energy because I know it's positive and I know it's safe. And they just want you to forgive you. They want you to forgive them, okay? I love y'all and happy Valentine's Day. Bye, y'all. Scorpios is really private, but we'll sting if you get close. Oh. And they rule by planet Mars, they stay determined, then don't go. go. Don't make a Scorpio strike because they venom pack a punch. So you better come correct, cause like a shark, you can't get much. Scorpios get what they want, and what they want is what they get. That's they appreciate they the ones they love, they ain't worth the fiction. Uh -uh. They don't really like people switching up, and they can't be kinda controlling, like, bitch. Shut the fuck up Shut Scorpios up. are leaders and they always think ahead And they also open minded so you gotta give them credit give them. If you date in the Scorpio and they like you, they will make you happy They also like a meal so in the kitchen, no you can't be like Scorpios are often trendy and they got the best drip And they do not disappoint man, you just gotta tap in Tagging shit is video, to a Scorpio you know